All right, how how are we doing this? What's up, dude? Are we are we doing the two v one or are we gonna hand off one of the mics to Didi for a big? Are we gonna interview? Eiffel Tower this boy? Or oh, we got another be, one. Uh, Go. All right, welcome aboard, Didi. First and foremost, congratulations. You Thank played you. like a monster. <laughs> Thank you. All right, talk to us about the run. H how did you feel coming into okay, the day? Okay, okay. So it's actually a long story. So <laughs> I did, I pulled out all the mental stops today. I, I went to bed early last night. I yeah. woke up like at 5.30. I went uh -huh. to the gym, went on a run, uh -huh. ate vegetables. <laughs> And then I came here, uh -huh. and I actually felt awful at first. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I lost 2-1 all three of my pool matches, including my first round. Wow. And uh, But I took a break after pools, and then uh -huh. uh, after that, I just felt it. Yeah? Yeah. Did, so you all the way through top 32, you really felt like you had I something really, going. Except for that set two, actually, set one, actually, yeah. grand finals. At the end, I was kind of... Yeah, yeah, show you played like a monster there. Yeah, but uh, everything else, I was really feeling it. Like let me like let me ask you something. You don't. Sometimes you take breaks from the game. Yes. <laughs> and no, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I, <laughs> Since when have you been playing? Okay. Um, for this time, for this period yeah, yeah, of yeah. Didi's life. So like, I took the break for like a year or so, and uh, probably like I went to an AZ local and. January. Okay. And after I did pretty well, and then after that, I started going to 805. Bla I don't know if you guys are familiar with Blast Zone. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like yeah, it's a Ventura, but it only gets like 10 people nowadays. Round robin tournament. Yeah, it's super chill though, super yeah. pull me. And uh, and uh, so I was going there for a couple months, and I, w I wasn't getting my ass kicked, but I'm uh, it wasn't it wasn't pretty. <laughs> and then uh, I started going to TMT like a month and a half ago, mm -hmm, and uh, mm -hmm. I've been on a hot streak ever since. You know, I called you for top four. Really? Yeah. But you know why? Because remember when we played at BMA? I do. You beat me. <laughs> yeah. Because I, I know what happens, okay? <laughs> I've seen into his soul, Raptor. I'm so bored of this conversation. And I know how it goes. <laughs> no, but that was seriously some, that, that was insane shit. Like, you beat all the guys Yeah. at the tournament. <laughs> Who was the hardest? Would it show you? Uh... I guess not counting your weird like yeah, pre pool not, not I guess or pre bracket. You can't really say anything to pools. Um, I feel like Shoyo was definitely the best player I played. I feel like I struggled the most actually against Beastly Turtle to get out of pools. Really? Did yeah. you play Fox? Yeah, he won game one, and then I was down two socks to one, I believe, game three, and I brought it back. So okay. that was definitely the hardest because um, top 32 before sh that grand finals, I only lost one game. I was just feeling it the whole time yeah so, yeah now one of the things about that top 32 run you uh you played a large range of characters right yeah. you played all sorts of people so you know at the top level hungry box he, he plays fox after fox after fox what are you doing as a puff main at this level to be ready for all these different matchups um just play as much as you can to be yeah. honest play yeah. as many different people uh-huh like, try to stick to your skill level mm -hmm. try to just find people who play those characters. Um, if I ever get stuck in something, like some matchup or some neutral change or whatever, I'll either kind of reflect on it for a little bit or I'll like watch a VOD and see what yeah. Underbox does or whatever. Yeah, absolutely. But uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Do you meditate? I you look like you meditate. I used to a lot. Um, I don't do the same thing where I used to where I would like sit down and actually do it. But like when I wake up out of bed, I'll do it. Um, if there's ever like a time where nothing's going on, I'm a little bored. I'll, I'll do it. But, boredom uh, meditation. Yeah, boredom meditation. When you're playing Shoyo, what were like? Because we were speculating on certain adaptations. Um, you really like to throw out up tilt rest at low percents. Oh yeah, absolutely. Why? 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 Because like crash cancels on deck. Obviously, he wasn't doing it that much, but like. Yeah. Uh, two reasons. Number one, I just don't think they expect it. Okay. Then because. Uh, they're low percent. They're not. I mean, it's puffs. So they can get the rest at any time, but they're not expecting to get killed right off the bat. So they usually don't expect the up tilt. And um, I can't remember the second reason. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good enough reason. Yeah, I guess. yeah. What were some adaptations that you were sort of muscling out in your head when you were playing them? Yeah. So he was definitely. Uh, well, I was doing well, and then he started doing the laser camping yeah. thing, and um, it took me a while to get used to it, but. I realized he wasn't really going for running up smash or any like jank up smashes, which uh, usually 
our, uh, my kryptonite. So I, I just realized he wasn't doing that. I was like, okay, I can play a little more riskier here. I don't have to go in right away, obviously, but I can kind of patrol this certain zone of neutral before, um, or and just not be worried about that up smash. Because that's really, uh, that's a big killer in the Puff matchup, IMO. Absolutely. Um, one of the other things that, you know, you're, you're sort of known for being like a not rest heavy Puff. Yeah. Um, but you found a lot of rest, especially against yeah. Shoyo in winners and grands finals. So, like, how did you, like, why did you want to go for more rests uh, this time around or, or in that matchup? And how did you know, like, when it was time to go for it? Um, are cu is cussing allowed? What? Is cussing allowed? Absolutely. Yeah, uh, yeah. It sounds cliche as fuck, but I just, I just felt it. Like, okay. the rest, like, like, I felt the way a few times playing melee, and uh -huh. um, that was definitely one of those times where I just, like, these rests just come out of nowhere. Uh-huh, yeah. uh-huh. Why yeah. don't you like resting? There's no reason for it, just kind of how my... It's not what you're about? No, I mean, like, I'm not, like, opposed to it at all. Just, like, kind of how my play style evolved. So it's like anal. Explain. <laughs> 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 so you got it. Right. So um, uh, I had a question I was going to ask you, and then I hit you with that zinger, and then it was gone. Um, how long have you been playing in general? So... I'd say I went to a PM tournament end of 2014, and then that got me into playing. And then I went to my first tournament, which was a. Actually, I hosted my own tournament, Andrew's Backyard, first, and then. Is that the one where Grape owed, uh, was it Mayor, like $5 or something? And they just wouldn't give, stop giving him shit about it? I've heard some shit has gone it, down a in lot the yard. Of, yeah, a lot, of, <laughs> lot of weird stuff like that always <laughs> happens. But um, so I hosted my first tournament actually, and then my first non uh, first tournament that wasn't my own was the JJ's in like February of 2015. But um, so yeah, it's about three, three and a half. Three and a half. Cool. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Awesome. So you did it. You won the Arcadian. Yeah. I, I imagine that's been like a, a big goal for you for the last couple weeks or months? Oh, my God. I couldn't, like, I was so excited last night. Like, I couldn't uh -huh. go to bed. I was like, oh, <laughs> I can't wait to so, play. And then, yeah. So what's next for Didi? Uh, I guess try to get ranked. Yeah? Um, I guess the pressure's on a little bit more now. Feels like this is a good step towards that ranking. Yeah. Are you looking to, to make any uh, national or big tournament yeah, appearances? Yeah, I'm going to my first uh, bigger tournament, I guess. It's mm. the, the run back in AZ. Awesome. Oh, really? Yeah. Cool, me too. Yeah, I'm going to get a lot of Peppa's merch. <laughs> good. Why do they sell Peppa's merch over there? Like, it's, it's a Because that's thing. where, like, Peppa's started. Really? Yeah. yeah. Did you start Peppa's? No. Uh, no, no, no. I kind of co-opted it and brought it to SoCal. Yeah. Like, oh. like, kind of like uh, the way Christopher Columbus brought, like, smallpox over to America. Yeah. Exactly that was, like that was kind of me. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So. I was always because I went to a, I've been to a couple locals there, a family up there, and it's like they're all repping Peppa. So I'm like, wow, like <laughs> this, <laughs> the reach, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like damn. But uh, okay, so you got you got run back on the list. Yeah. A any other big stuff you're planning on going to? <laughs> Haven't looked into it yet. Um, no, it just not a lot of time at the moment. Sure, sure. Uh, I'll try to go wherever I can. Absolutely. But, uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Now that you're an Arcadian winner here in SoCal, I mean. That's a that's a big name to live up to, right? I guess so. <laughs> you're a colossus now. You're you're soaring above everyone, above Hulka. <laughs> above Hulka. That's all I care about. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's also like uh, you can take the Arcadian money you won, pay for Drug Fox coaching lessons with it, hey. become <laughs> ranked. I don't know, man. I'm just uh, I'm trying to figure out like the the path here, the monetary yeah, I mean investment path. Of the Arcadian, you know, sort yeah. of money. <laughs> I'm gonna definitely buy all the 805 boys dinner right oh. now. Oh, nice! Yeah. I heard they were popping off for you throughout the tournament. Yeah. H how do you feel about having like a crowd behind oh you? Oh my God, it's amazing. You <laughs> love it. It's, it's so. It is not just the crowd itself, but just having them out here. It's, yeah. Uh, it, it makes it like if it was just me and and Puff. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's rough, but uh, you know, having the 805 people. I mean, yeah. It's amazing. They're amazing. Cool. Cool. Uh, Do we have anything else to ask this champion, this legend, this monolith? I guess. I guess the last thing I want to ask is like, all right, you did it, right? Like you, you got there. You won the Arcadian. What are you thinking right now? Like, how do you feel right now? Uh, is it like, is it relief? Are you just excited? Like, 
Where are you at? You know, when I won winners semis and finals, I want to say I was like, oh my God, this is happening. Mm -hmm. But uh, after that, I just, I felt a little kind of calm. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so you're just, just locked like, in, yeah, huh? Yeah, I, I did it. And as um, far as after this, I uh, just keep doing more of what I'm doing because it's, it's working, I guess. Absolutely. And uh, yeah. That's awesome. I'm looking for your, uh, your, your sheet here. I don't think you're even in here. Uh, Did you even is, register? Oh, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Well, I think that's all we've got for right now. Right. Once again, congratulations. You had an amazing run. And, I mean, you really put, uh, put, put the hurt on some people with your puff. It was sick to watch, sick to commentate. And uh, I think I hope the people at home loved it, too. hope so. All right. Thanks, guys. Congratulations, <laughs> Didi. You did Thank it, you. buddy. Good, Good stuff, man. All right. Catch all right, guys. guys. Later. I think that's it for the SoCal Arcadian. I hope you enjoyed your time here. Um, I think we got some hitters coming up. I think that's really the story of the day, right? Yeah. I mean, Epic Murloc is out here throwing purple shoes onto every man he can. And that's great. Yeah. yeah. And I like that, you know. Definitely. Dawson, Dawson's doing some announcements right now. So uh, what's the plan, Jed? Do we just cut out? What do you want us to Okay. Do we, do we commentate we're gonna, this? We're going to commentate it, but... Don't steal the spotlight. Right. Dawson, very used to this. He is in a band. <laughs> That's a roast. All right, looks like we're going to do a quick... Uh, Vavez is here. Vavez only entered doubles because that's how he plays the game. Yeah, he's and he a, just He's a salty it, old you know? man. I couldn't agree more. Doesn't like singles. All right, so we're going to have like a little award ceremony here real quick. Uh. Oh. So big, big shout out to Nut and Bavez. They came in the clear favorites to win doubles. Yep. They've uh, done a ton of work and they were able <laughs> to win Nug it out. Say? Nut gets a talk? Oh no. I like this. <laughs> I love Nut. I, lo I love that they came out here and they just did what they had to do. Uh, those two, so strong. Epic Murloc taking third place in singles. Good stuff, good stuff. Destroying Noir, my boy. And uh, pu just putting up a, a ton of really good performances throughout the tournament. Only lost to Shoyo. Um, and, and even then, it was close, and it looked really strong. Yeah. Shoyo. <laughs> Nuts flipping off Shoyo. But Second he, place. You know what? He came. He did his thing. He doesn't live in Hawaii anymore. He's here. He's out here, and he uh, he let us know he's he's not to be trifled with. He's a strong player and right. not at all uh, weak. He, he's he's ready to play. <laughs> Didi. Once again, with the big smile, the nicest teeth in esports.com. Once again, huge shout out to Didi. Big congratulations. He played like a monster throughout the day uh, and was able to destroy. I didn't know he prepared for so long. Yeah. Didi, Didi goes MIA from Melee sometimes. Yeah. And then he's just like, no, let's really do it, you know? Yeah, he, he definitely he, he had a goal and he came out here today and he made it happen. Yeah. Uh, real impressed by his play throughout the day and, and he was able to do it all, you know? What a good time. What a good time for the boys. Wow. I nut, mean, nut, can I feel it? What, nice. a, what a ridiculous tournament throughout. I want to put my fingerprint on it. Don't ever wash that off. <laughs> All right, guys. Chill for what? Uh, for a double. Don't let Chong on the mic. All right, guys. I think Dawson that's gonna says be we can't let Chong on the mic. That's going to be it for us, guys. We're done here. All right, all right, we're done. I'm going to I'm gonna cut it out before anything else happens. <laughs> Wait, on your stream? No, get the fuck out of here. All right, guys. All right. Congratulations to our top players. Uh, Nut and Vavis taking first in doubles. I'd like to plug um, Ram Ranch 7. It recently came out three days ago. Uh, 18 Naked Cowboys. Shout out to Josh Kano. Shut it down. Shut it down. All right, guys. Jet, shut it down. Guys, it's 18 been... naked Cowboys in the showers at Ram Ranch. Tomorrow, you'll learn about doubles. I've been fighting doubles in SoCal Melee. <laughs>
<laughs> oh my God. All right, guys, congratulations to our top uh, three finishers. Didi taking first place, Shoyo with a strong showing in second, and uh, Epic Murloc handing it off in third. And thanks to Jet for streaming and the whole production crew. Thanks to Nixon. Yeah, show us Nixon. Where is he? Right there. Follow every SoCal Melee stream. All of them. All yeah, of this them. was. Except Chong's. <laughs> Don't uh, follow the American Ass Eater. Uh, big final shout out to our TOs. Uh, a bunch of TOs from throughout SoCal came together to make this tournament happen. So I just wanted to shout out uh, Dawson, Jerry, uh, Trike, Trikelman, Face and, and Faceroll uh, for all coming together and making that happen. Um, we had two amazing streams throughout the day. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, our commentary and uh, all the stuff that we had for you today. And I don't know, man. Uh, I'm really excited for the future of SoCal Melee. This uh, Arcadian was super hype. Uh, heavy, heavy competition. And I, I think there's a lot of hitters out there. If I was ranked in SoCal right now, I'd be shaking in my boots. Yeah, dude, and it's just, it's the boys. Yeah. And the girls, obviously. Everyone who comes out, it's just, I don't know. Hey, even Salami's here. <laughs> That's not too bad. <laughs> Coming around. All right. Is that it? Awesome. Done? Yeah. Goodbye, everybody. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Good night. <laughs> ah.